Fluid intelligence is a subtype of general intelligence. Fluid intelligence refers to the ability to think on one's feet and, importantly, does not rely on any prior knowledge or experience. On test day, you may need to differentiate between fluid and another subtype of general intelligence known as crystallized intelligence. It can be hard to keep these two apart, so in this video, I'll share my mnemonic for fluid intelligence so you'll be ready to nail it on test day. Ah, there's nothing more refreshing than drinking fluid after playing some intense ball. Look at that player rehydrating with these bottles of sports fluid. He must be really thirsty after a hard game. His fluid should remind us that we're talking about fluid intelligence. He better finish his drink soon, because it looks like the game is in play. Let's join the game, shall we? Who's playing on the court? I see that we have a team of total newbies here. Not only are these kids dressed in casual gear, they're also super skinny. Yep, these kids are definitely not professionals. In fact, I doubt they've played a minute of basketball in their life until now. These kids, being complete novices, should help you remember that fluid intelligence does not rely on prior knowledge nor experience. You know, since these kids have no prior experience playing basketball, right? That kid just airballed so hard, he's really showing his lack of experience. In the heat of the game, you don't get a lot of time to stop and think. That's right, you gotta move fast and make quick decisions on your feet. I'm talking about game time thinking. These kids playing basketball are clearly thinking on their feet. They've never played basketball before, but they're picking it up pretty quickly. That's a nice parallel for how fluid intelligence works. It's all about adaptive or quick thinking. Remember, fluid intelligence does not depend on prior knowledge, so there's no need to search your memories or use analytical thinking. Instead, fluid intelligence is about moving fast and making snap decisions using only the situation in front of you. Remember this quick-paced game to remember that fluid intelligence refers to game-time thinking or thinking on one's feet. Uh-oh, it looks to me like that older man has been left out of the game. Back in his younger years, this guy used to be a star on the court. Now, the rude teens here won't even let this guy join their game. How inconsiderate. By the way, this picture should help you remember that fluid intelligence decreases with age. Fluid intelligence peaks in young adulthood and decreases as you get older. In other words, our ability to make snap decisions and adapt quickly decreases as we age, which is perhaps why sports are best left to young people. Just remember this old man left out of the court to remember how fluid intelligence decreases with age. All right, that's it for fluid intelligence. Let's recap quickly before we miss too much of the game. Fluid intelligence is a type of general intelligence you'll need to know for the MCAT. Fluid intelligence describes thinking and solving problems on your feet without relying on prior knowledge or experience. In other words, it's about adaptive or game time thinking on our feet. Fluid intelligence peaks in young adulthood and decreases as we age. And now we're actually done with fluid intelligence. Whew. Let's get back to rooting for these newbies on the court. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this one, click here to subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also support our team by visiting pixarize.com, where you'll find exclusive videos and interactive review images. If you like what we're doing, share with your friends on social media, and we'll keep making great content like this. We'll see you next time.